shoulder. Mba no get their own for back. Everybody get it. Over. Some people not jump and they jump their own. Okay, only say two minutes because our time is gone. Amen. Tell us why you brought this um, this goat with the peace for, for, for altar. Praise the Lord. Praise our Lord Jesus. Uh, brethren, I'm very glad to be here today. This, this is a very long testimony. Two, uh, uh, very long, but make it two minutes. Yes, I'm going to brief it. Thank you. Uh, but notwithstanding, I have to brief it and for more a little understanding why I'm here. Uh, so they know you are you. Yeah, it's a very long journey in the faith. Uh, because I've been in this faith for quite years now. When the message came to the Nigeria, that is 1999. I've been, I've been on the faith with John Ogu and all that 
But through the journey, it was a very rough journey for me because of um, in the wrong directions. But I thank God today, I never knew God moved the way he moves here. Because I've been watching and watching the promises of God has not come the way God promises through the ages. William Abraham came, a lot of things he did, I never seen it. But today, I'm a living witness here to acknowledge all the experience Amen. and the work of God here. So I'm happy because I can't just tell the stories of the churches I pass and all the experience and all the ideas and all the um, kind of men wisdom in the message. But I thank God today, the move of God here. I praise the Lord for, the, for that. Hallelujah. Uh, just my wife has uh, some little things to say about our testimony. About yeah, she has something to show yes, us too. About my son, uh -huh. and about the experience we have, trials, temptations, but today, it's another music, another story. Amen. I really thank God for it. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Can I hear you say praise the Lord? I thank God so much. I am so excited to be here in your midst today. Uh, this baby came as a consolation. Where we have said, as a man, we said after the twins, we said that was 14 years ago. We said we don't want a baby again. But last year, and the battle was really tough. The going was really tough. Frustrations here and there. That was when God decided to give us this baby. Clap your hands now. 40 years after, they said they don't even want a game. And God still said, I must give you. What of you will want? And you have been calling upon that God. Somebody be in expectation. Anybody looking for fruit of the womb here, you should challenge God. This one, they say they no want to get. You still say they must get. What of me when they ask them? That is evidence your own is coming. Hallelujah. If you are here, you believe it, jump up and shout, I claim my own. I claim my own. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So that was it. So when he came, it was like something of sadness. But immediately I stepped my foot on this church. They began to tell me, sister, we saw a baby following you. Not even one prophet, not two. Each time they say it because we were really going through trauma. I was like, please don't see baby for me. See money. Because I don't want baby again. If, the, if God should give babies, he should give it to my younger sister, my friends. A lot of them, they are out there looking for babies. But as God we have it, I became pregnant. With all the protections and everything. We, I was crying. I was like, and that was the time I got admission into the higher school. So I said, how am I going to cope? We were financially down. As you can hear, down. We were crying. I was like, God, oh, the, the, the Bible said that you can never give me a gift that will make me to sorrow. Why did you decide to give me this baby? But I am believing that that God that gave me when I needed not a baby. You that are looking for how much more, as daddy has said it, God will definitely bless you all. Amen. And throughout all things and thin, there will be time I will not eat as a pregnant woman. I registered hospital. Most people, they didn't know what I passed through. I registered antidental at eight months. But my sister was there for me. My, my friends were there for me. My pastors, they were there for me. So I give God all the glory because he saw me through. Amen. Somebody Amen. suggested to me, he said, during the labor, don't try to go through labor. Just tell them to open you up. You know, it's been long you put to bed. That Satan is waiting for you there. I said, well, the God that put it there will definitely bring this baby out. Thank you. Thank you. I had some funny dreams. I met with daddy. I was afraid. Daddy said, I am not going to pray for you. Because daddy never prayed for me one day. He had this faith that each time I go to daddy, daddy, please pray for me. Daddy will say, your own, I don't have problem. Go. Even the day I was in labor, I called him. He never picked, but when he, he called me back, he said, you don't deliver. He said, I know, say, so your own will be a problem. Go and deliver this baby. Don't have fear because the day, you see this baby is a miracle child. The day God will bring out this baby, you will not have problem. Even those your enemies, they will be asleep. 
and God did it perfectly. Clap your hands now. Clap your hands, church. And ever since this baby came, believe me, you there is there's, there's been a turn around in my life. Mm. Physically, spiritually. Uh -huh. So I am so glad. Amen. Whatever thing you are believing God to do for you today, hang on. Never give up. God will definitely visit you. It's unchangeable God. The irreversible reviser. There is nothing he cannot do. Therefore, I have a song to give God the glory. Because I told him that when you see me through, in the midst of this trouble, in the midst of this agony, that I will sing. And I will not fail to remember the children I called. They were all the while practicing this song. They said, Mommy, we are going to sing a song. <laughs> the children, they were coming from Songo this morning. They said that the vehicle they were about to enter, that a trailer just ran into it, and yeah. everybody in that vehicle was like bread. So I give God all the glory because he, he has done it. Clap your hands again for our God. Amen. Please, Daddy, let me sing my song. Sing, John. There are two goats here for that song. Enu, 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 bunye Jesus. Why she singing? The nursing mother, stand up and get ready with your babies for dedication. Nursing mother, stand up.
bless you. God bless you. Come to the altar. Come to the altar with the baby while the other children 